climate fuel disasters are radically transforming the world we live in. With the increasing amount of deaths, displacements, and economic damages acting as a wake-up call for many. The severe storms, wildfires, inland floods, crop freezes, droughts, and tropical cyclones have touched nearly everyone around the world. And yet, news coverage routinely underplays the central drama of these disasters. More often than not, it's the people living in the affected communities that, despite all the obstacles, rise to the occasion to save lives, reduce suffering, and form a community of care. It's what the author Rebecca Solnit describes as disaster collectivism, the sense of immersion in the moment and solidarity with others, caused by the rupture in everyday life, an emotion graver than happiness, but deeply positive. And the reimagining of what's possible doesn't stop after the initial recovery is over. Instead, it continues as communities regenerate often increasing their equity, resilience, and capacity for joy. This is The Response, a podcast and documentary series exploring the remarkable communities that arise in the aftermath of disasters.